Hello and welcome back to another edition of World's Grill Shack. Today we're cooking loaded potato skins. Now do you ever think, I want to cook jack of potato on the barbecue, but it's just a little bit boring? Well this recipe is going to spec that up massively. And what I mean by that is we're going to hit that jack of potato with some beautiful cherry smoke and then we're going to scoop out the insides and we're going to mix it with some cheese, some sour cream, some chives and a few other ingredients and this is going to be top notch. So let's head on over to the bench and I'm going to show you how to prep the potatoes. Okay and here are our potatoes that we're using. So we're using three potatoes and all I've done is scrub the outside of these and now what we're going to do is we're going to prick them with the metal so they cook a little bit quicker. So we're just going to go in like that just like so all the way around and repeat the process for all three of them. Okay, these are now all ready to go onto the smoker. Um, so let's now let, head over to the big green egg and let's fire it up. Okay, so the Mini Max is now sat at uh, 210 degrees, which is what we're looking for. We've got an indirect, so you can see we've got the uh, bottom plate in here. And we've also added some cherry wood uh, for some smoke in the chamber. So now what we're gonna do is pop these lovely of potatoes straight onto the middle of the grill close that down and now we're going to just let that sit at 210 degrees for about an hour and then we'll come back okay half an hour in temperature's sat lovely so we're just going to give these a little turnover you can see we're getting some nice crispy skin on the outside so we want to get that all the way around really so we're just going to turn those over and we're going to pop back in another 30 minutes Okay, so we're just over the hour mark. Just look at the colour. Got that lovely crispy skin on the outside. So what we're going to do is take these off, pop them into a bowl, and we're just going to let those cool on the side for about 10 minutes just to make it a little bit easier to handle. Okay, so what we're now going to do is slice these straight in half. Now they are going to be not cooked all the way through as you can see there, but what we're going to do is scoop these out of the skins and put them in a separate dish. So you can see they're pretty much there. But when we scoop them out, they're gonna be spot on. So we're gonna grab our spoon, just like so. And we're just gonna scoop out some of this potato. And this is how we want it to look. So you can see we've left a little bit around the outside, just taken out the middle, and that is absolutely perfect. And we've got the remainder just in there. And that is all the potato that we've got left over. So now I'll put all the uh, measurements, the exact measurements into the description so you can check that out. Um, but this is just cheddar, grated cheddar cheese. We've got some lovely crispy bacon that I've fried down. So I'm just gonna pop that in. We've also got um, some spring onions in there. So we're gonna pop those in. We've got some sour cream. So we're gonna want a good load of that in there. And also we're gonna pop some butter in there and this isn't room temperature, so just cutting that down. Then a little bit of uh, salt in there and some cracks of some pepper as well. Now we're just gonna mix that mix all together. Okay, and that is what it looks like when it's all mixed up, a lovely, creamy sour cream mash beautiful so we've now got our potato skins back and what we're going to do is grab a dollop of that and we're just going to fill this nicely in there the trick is to just make sure it's nice and smooth all over the top because that is going to look lovely And there you go. Now we're going to do the same with the rest of them. Also what I've done is just put a little stick of butter um, just over the top and then I've got some smoked paprika here just for a little bit of colour. I'm just going to sprinkle that all over the top. Okay so we're back on the Mini Max. Pick it up, pop it on. So they're all on there. I'm just going to close that down now and give it another 30 odd minutes and we'll come back and have a look at them. And 20 minutes on, you can see these are bubbling away and they are looking really good. So we're gonna get these off and take a look at them on the bench. Now this is what I'm talking about. You've got the bacon bits, you've got the lovely color from the paprika, cheesy inside. 
It's nice and crispy on the top as well, and the skins are crispy. It's exactly what you want from some loaded potatoes. Cool. How good did those potatoes look? And they had the best skin on them that I've ever had. It was literally like extra smoky, which is just absolutely perfect. Now that is a surefire recipe that is gonna make your jack of potatoes the next level at your next barbecue. So there you go, another absolute killer recipe. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit subscribe to the channel. Join me next time for another edition of Will's Grill Shack. Thanks for watching.